fire engulfs shops on Melbourne's busy Chapel Street, causing peak hour chaos. A heavily pregnant woman bashed and robbed in Melbourne's north. A weather warning as icy winds hit the city. Egypt erupts in celebration and chaos as the military overthrows the president. And two of Collingwood's premiership stars out for tomorrow night's blockbuster against Carlton. Live from Melbourne, this is 7 News with Jennifer Kite. Good evening. Fire has engulfed stores on one of Melbourne's busiest shopping streets this afternoon. The blaze tore through several Chapel Street businesses, causing traffic chaos. Kate Osborne is in South Yarra. Kate, tell us what happened. Well, Jen, being school holidays, Chapel Street was crowded with people when the blaze broke out about quarter past three this afternoon. It started in the beauty clinic on the first floor. Of the... Win or lose, they're behind him until the finish line. Michael Scanlon, 7 News. And after the break, how hero Melbourne police officers saved a man's life. A farm sanctuary SOS, the woman needing your help to save animals on death row. And Prince Charles proves he's a big Doctor Who fan. That's very good. Two young police officers are being praised for saving the life of a driver found not breathing and slumped over the steering wheel of his locked car in Sydenham. Constables Jaden Gebby and Cheryl DeLima used their batons to clearly a fan. Not bad. We'll time now for sport with Sandy Roberts. Thank you, Jen. And coming up, the Bombers boss goes on the attack over the drug scandal. Collingwood suffers three shock injuries on the eve of tomorrow's crucial Carlton clash as the Blues skipper returns from a nasty injury and stage five carnage on the tour. Hello again. We'll have all the latest team news on tomorrow night's Carlton Collingwood blockbuster in a moment. But first, a breaking news out of Essendon with club chairman David Evans rejecting claims AOD 9604 is a performing enhancing drug. And our medical and pharmacological advice is that even if the players were given AOD 9604 last year... Seven, it's on 7-2, it starts at 10pm and Jen, it is women's semi-finals night, going to be a big night. Should be great, thank you very much Sandy. The Wednesday lotto draw now and the winning combination is 32, 33, 3, 29, 23 and 45. The supplementaries are 37 and 25. And Gian's back after the break with more on our cold snap. Good evening again. As we mentioned earlier, the wind was quite destructive today. Gusts of up to 78 kilometres an hour were recorded here in Melbourne. However, we reached a warmer than expected top of 16.3 degrees just after 2.30 this afternoon after an overnight low of 9.6. While at the moment, it's around 14 degrees. On the Should be fresh tracks for the weekend. I'll see you when you're shredding. And that's 7 News from the team. Have a lovely evening. And now here's Helen with Today Tonight.